Hey everybody, this is Ray, and today I wanted to do a quick overview of Tube Overlay Wizard. Uh, last night I sent you guys an email that showed you, or that talked about this new software program, but I've gotten a few questions from people not quite understanding what, uh, what that was all about, so I wanted to do a quick video to show you what that's about. For those of you who don't know, uh, I recently sold a, created and sold a product that showed you how to make clickable links on your YouTube videos, and it's a great process that works really well for driving traffic directly to your money sites and whatnot. The only problem with it is it's kind of a pain in the neck to use. Uh, it's a great little hack, but it, it, it's a pain in the neck. You have to go log into your AdWords account, create a campaign, set the whole campaign up, put the information in there. Then you have to save it, go to YouTube, open that up, enable that, go inside there, fill in the same information that you already put in the other one. And it's a big hassle, but it's well worth it. Uh, what has actually happened here with Tube Overlay Wizard is somebody has taken that information and they've created a uh, mm -hmm. software that automatically goes in and does all that work for you so you don't have to do all that again. So here's Tube Overlay Wizard. When you open it up, it's basically just a modified web browser that shows YouTube here. And where you hit the Tools button and the Settings, and this window pops up here mm -hmm. that the information on here you'll, you'll probably recognize it's very similar to what you'd see inside of AdWords as far as what you have here. Uh, you have to start off by logging into your AdWords account. Okay, and then over here you're going to put your U YouTube username. Now it says username, but what I've discovered is you have to put your email that you use to log in. And I think this is just because YouTube can't seem to decide whether they want you to use a username or your email, but I, I noticed that when I tried it with just my username, it, it told me I needed a, um, uh, an email. And then we're going to put your password in there so it can automatically log in for you. And then the URL of the desired overlay edition. So this is the video you want to have the overlay on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here and I'm going to use this particular one here. So I'm just going to go in copy the URL and I'm gonna place that in here and then it also wants the unique identifier now that's just the everything after the equal sign here so you're gonna have youtube.com slash watch uh, question mark V equals and then everything after the equal oops, is the identifier so we're gonna copy that and we're gonna paste that in here and then we're gonna go to our overlay and all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna because I'm basically uh, advertising the same thing. I'm just going to use one that I've already done. You need an animated logo. Pop that in here. Oops. Maybe. There we go. And we'll take the line one. Copy that. Paste that in here. Same thing for line two. And then for the image URL, I've got one already here that I used before. Uh, all this is is just a 56 by 56 pixel image that you're going to use in the overlay. It's just going to show a little icon there. And you just upload that somewhere. It can be your Dropbox or, or somewhere on your website. Just a one file, no big deal. And we're going to paste that into there. The display URL, this is what you want people to see. So I'm just going to put animate your logo.com so that's what they're going to see in the ad so they're going to see the the two lines and then they're going to see this URL here and then you want to put the real URL down here now the reason I say real in, in my case it's going to be the same except for um, I'm going to spell it right the only difference being the HTTP and the www uh, but basically, I'm going to the same thing. If you had something longer, like animate your logo slash something slash something, then you'd put that here, and then you'd still put animateyourlogo.com because that's what you want people to see. And then you simply hit build my overlay. And what it's going to do, if I drag this out of the way, you can see it, it's actually a script that's going to run. It's going to go to the AdWords, and it's going to do all the stuff that you would normally have to do multiple times and takes forever and is a pain in the neck. It's going to do all that for you automatically. It's going to fill in all your information. And then in a few minutes, you're going to have it finished. I'm not going to sit here and have this video running while you're waiting for that to happen. So what we'll do is I will pause this and I will come back in just a few minutes. 
Okay, so we've been through the whole process, and as you can see here, it says success. Your overlay has been created. So we're just going to hit OK. And that's pretty much it. So if we come back to our video, you can now see that we have a tab here that says Call to Action Overlay. If we click that, all of our information is in here. And if we go back and go to our video itself, we should have, and there it is, an, a logo, uh, excuse me, a, a clickable banner link on the video that advertises our product. And if we click on that, it's going to take us to the website. So for those of you who have uh, been using the Clickable Links product, this is a great way to automate that so you don't have to go through the whole process. And if you haven't done it before, this is a great time to jump on board and get something like this because it's a great way to drive traffic directly to some of your products. Uh, recently, we did an affiliate launch for one of the big uh, affiliate programs, App Empire, and we used videos and we ranked them on the page one and we put the Clickable Links in there. And we sold, you know, about $20,000 worth of the product in just a couple of days. And as far as we can tell, it was all through the videos with people watching them and clicking through. So uh, this is something that can really help you out and can really be profitable if done right. So if you haven't done it before, give it a shot. If you have done it before and you've been through the tedious process, this is a great time to be able to do that without uh, having to go through all the stress and pain. So check it out. And if you have any questions, please let me know and I'll be glad to answer them for you. Thanks.